going on now is a return to normality. Because 10 or 15 years ago, we didn't do business like this. We weren't reliant on credit. We weren't reliant on, on bank loans or mortgages or any of those things. Basically, you had to generate your cash to sustain your business. So those old age things are cash, for example.
The only place where this falls down is where you fail, the human element where you might fail to say to someone that you meet at a networking, how did you find out about us? But do it. Measure the effectiveness of your marketing. So, when there was a very real threat that we might have been invaded by the Nazis, a civil servant somewhere came up with this very simple message. So if we are invaded, I've got goosebumps thinking about it now. <laughs> Wartime spirit. So if we are invaded by the Nazis, the advice coming from government was to keep calm and carry on. <laughs> Isn't that a fantastic message? What's going on with this now is that somebody found this behind a load of books that they bought about two years ago, set up a website, keepcalmcarryon.com, and is now shipping three to 500 products a week. Cups, t-shirts, posters, keep calm and carry on is the message. Now this was a revelation for me when I found this in October. I spent five pounds on a little postcard and it sits on our wall and this was the message. But of course, we've evolved the message since then. So now the Effective Marketing Club Company are telling you to get excited and kick ass. <laughs> That's me. Thank you very much. That's still too close.